Yo, what is good everybody, dude? I'm so tired right now, it's like 11, but dude, I could literally crash right now. But I'm gonna show you guys how to actually stop getting your apps revoked that you downloaded from like Tweakbox or the Tutu app or whatever, and it's actually really simple. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, let's just go ahead and open Tutu Helper or Tutu app, and you see this little like box diagram thing that comes up? That happens to me literally like once or twice a week, and I have to literally uninstall all my apps, and I have to re-download them, and it's so annoying. And this is on my iPhone 5. This is running iOS 10.3.3, but this does work on iOS 11. I'm gonna show you guys how to exactly right now. So here I have my iPhone SE, and where I'm gonna show you guys how to basically do it. I don't have the T2 app installed on here yet, but I installed it on my iPhone 6S Plus and it worked 100% fine. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna go to the first link in the description and it'll take you to a website like this. And you wanna go ahead and just click install. And it'll take you to like a like an ad thing right here. You just like chill out for a second. And you wanna make sure you do this in Safari. If you do this in Chrome or something, it's not going to work once that thing opens you can just click skip ad and a little ad thing will come right here you just want to click close you can like hop out of this ad real quick come back here click skip ad and then once this little diagram comes up you want to click allow and it'll take you into your settings you just go ahead and click install and it'll make you type in your passcode and then once you type in your passcode you can just click next and then install and click install once more. I'll go ahead and install and you can just click done. And now that's pretty much it. But now you'll see you have a little app right there, the anti-lock. You wanna go ahead and open that. And this will just say update or whatever. And you wanna make sure it's on. So once it's on, it's pretty much on. So now you can like literally hop out of this and just like swipe out of it. And you don't really need to worry about it anymore. And of course I need to give credit to the hack spot. I kind of forgot to say that in the beginning of this video. But one thing you wanna note though, is that it might not work, but I would just do this second step just to keep yourself safe. You wanna open up the app store and you wanna search up this app called, called VPN Robot. And it's the first one right here. Just go ahead and click install. There you go. You wanna go ahead and just open it. And then it'll, okay, and then once a little app comes up, this little thing up here, you want to click allow. And then you can just hold on your touch ID and it'll like pat, like go through it for you. And then once you get there, you want to hit connected and it'll stop and it'll disconnect it. And you want to tap to connect once more. And then once you're connected, you want to hop out of it and you'll see up top, you'll see VPN right there. Now for me, this was really, really, really annoying. But I found out a way to fix it. All you have to do is just go back in and just disconnect it. And you should still be good to go. And the way you can verify it is if you go to the second or third link, I'll put like verify slash and I'll put the link there so you guys can tell. If you get an image that says something I don't even remember, it's like some stupid image. If you get that, then it means it worked. But if you get like 404 not found, this, that, that means it didn't work. So you might as well just download the VPN robot right now. Or you can use any VPN you want to. For me, I just used VPN robot. It was the easiest one. That's what the Hackspot recommended. And yeah, guys, that's about it. Hopefully this is permanent. That's what everyone's saying. But you know, in the future, you never know if Apple's going to patch it or something. But I'm cool with it. It's been a while since you guys seen this phone. But I put the anti-lock and the VPN robot both in my phone and it works so far i have the gba for ios right here too and it's working perfectly fine if you guys don't know how to put that on i'll leave the, check out one of my last videos and i have all my plus plus apps right here that i use except twitter plus plus but yeah and that's that's pretty much it hopefully i mean i'll keep you guys updated almost on my phone i'll keep you guys updated if this like for some reason stops i'll upload it on twitter and i'll let you guys know so follow me on there i just add me on all the social networks right now i usually say it at the end of the video but I'm, this is the end of the video if it helped you out though hit the like button subscribe if you're new that It'll definitely mean a ton. Comment if you guys have any questions or concerns. I'll be happy to answer your questions. I post videos every single day. So I haven't missed a day in like a week or two. So, and I'm low-key like right now. I'm really tired, but I'm really not trying to show it. You guys seen the time? It's 1050. I'm out here grinding while you guys are sleeping. <laughs> I'm just joking, guys. You guys work hard too. I know you guys work hard. But dude, more importantly than anything else I've said in this video, I love all of you guys. And hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.